guys, it is Saturday and it's weigh day. So, got on the scales this morning and no surprise, it's a gain. So I actually gained three, which is horrendous, but I have been pretty much off plan all week because it was my birthday week. That's a thing, right? This week, I'm gonna work super hard to get that three off, at least. I can't have that hanging about. I've got weight I need to shift. Let's start with those three pounds. This week, I'm gonna be doing absolutely everything to plan. All my snacks, all my meals. I'm gonna organize everything really well to make sure that I can get those three pounds off. I'm also gonna weigh out all my healthy extras, my A's and B's, my milks, my oats, all my Cheerios, to make sure that everything is as it should be. It makes it easier to stay on plan if everything's a bit prepped beforehand. I'm going to be going through my food diary and doing a meal plan for breakfast, lunch and dinner for this week. I'm also going to think about snacks, healthy, good alternatives. Just looking at being a bit more conscious about making sure that I'm getting more speed foods in and um, staying to plan 100%. I know that sometimes I'm a bit hit and miss and sometimes I snack on stuff which isn't great and I've also got a Tesco shop coming this week so I've put loads of fruit and veg on there to stock up on to help me make better choices and what's even better is because I've been so off plan this week the cupboards are now bare of all the like the good stuff which is great because it's not there to tempt me doesn't help that Aaron keeps baking amazing stuff he's made donuts today I'm very excited about them I'm gonna have some because it is technically cheat day I'm really not starting well. I'm also going to stay away from breads as well. Aaron's been making some amazing bread, which is really frustrating because I love bread. It smells amazing, it tastes amazing, but it's so good. And Aaron is just amazing at baking it. So I'm going to knock all that on the head. The bread that is not Aaron. Just be better. I have to be better. It's been nice this week to just have a chilled week and not really worry about what I'm eating, but I've paid the price. I've put on three and that is not good especially when I've still got an absolute load that I want to lose by the end of the year. So I've got to get a wriggle on. Anyway, I hope you guys are doing well and I hope your way day was much kinder than mine was. Drop me a comment below. I'd love to hear from you guys. Or if you've got any really good ideas for snacks. Oh my gosh, that's kind of where I struggle sometimes. Snacks though, I find really difficult. So if you guys have got a really good snack idea, I've been having some baby bells, always a winner, using up some healthy extra A and they're really yummy. But if you guys have any other good snack ideas, please let me know. I could do with your help. And that's kind of been my week and kind of what I have planned for the week ahead. Keeping it nice and chilled today. The sun is out. Whoop whoop. So we are going to get in the garden and do some gardening this morning. And I think that's a pretty good way to start the day. Hey guys, it is no makeup Sunday. No makeup Sunday. And today I'm taking a very, very chilled day. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna to use today as like my prep day. So this morning, I'm gonna do all my weighing out, all my weighing out of my oats and Cheerios and all that kind of stuff. So I've got them all bagged up, ready to go for the rest of the week. Then I'm also gonna do a bit of a food plan as well, get me breakfast, lunch and dinner kind of sorted. I might ever think about snacks. Need some snack ideas. So I'm gonna think peruse some of my Slim World books and my magazines for any really good snack ideas. That's going to be kind of my morning. Then this afternoon, very chilled. Food wise today, I'm going to make a chicken based pizza for tea. Very excited about that. Absolutely love it. If you want to check out a recipe for that, I've got a link in the description below. Then for lunch, don't really know what I'm going to have yet because I'm going to make this morning a nice big like mini fry up. They're not mini at all. They're just not actually fried. Totally sin friendly, so I think I'm gonna do one of those with like eggs and beans and mushrooms and all that kind of stuff. Yes, I'm very excited. So that's pretty much my day today. I hope you guys are having a good week and I'll get in super organized and trying to stay on plan as best you can during lockdown. Drop me any of your good tips and tricks on how you're keeping on plan, I'd love to hear from you guys. And don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so you're kept up to date with all my yummy recipes and the rest of my vlog journey. Right, I'm gonna make breakfast. Hey guys, it's Monday and I'll just crack on with what I had for breakfast. So this morning I just had some oats. I had 40 grams of porridge oats with some of my milk, using up some of my healthy extra. Then with that I just had a banana and a drizzle of honey, my absolute fave, I love it in the morning 
think I need to change it up a bit. I've had oats for a bit now, so yeah, I need to change it up. It's actually lunchtime, and today for lunch, I've got a little bit of chili leftover, so I'm gonna have that, and I think I'm gonna make some burrito wraps. Instead of using a kind of wrap, what I'm gonna do is use some salad leaves. I'm just gonna get some big iceberg leaves, put the chili and my bits and bobs in that, wrap it all up, done. I'm very excited about it. So it is the end of the day, I've just finished work and I thought I would just do some nice relaxing yoga to end my day. That was nice, yoga done. And now I'm feeling super chilled and I've done a nice workout. So I'm gonna go and make some tea. Don't really know what I'm gonna have today. The burritos were delish earlier, especially in the salad wraps, they were amazing. Great lunch. So I'm not feeling super, super hungry, but I could eat. Hey guys, it's Wednesday and I'm starting my day with a walk out and about in the forest with the girls. Shame it's really raining though. Indiana. So there's a load of people down there, so we have, I don't know if they're coming this way or whatever, we have turned around and we're going back the way we came. <laughs> Staying away from people, being safe. This morning for breakfast, I had some amazing Cheerios. I say amazing, they were just Cheerios, so they're actually really yummy, so that was fab. Then, the, um, just doing my walk, and then I'm going back home to cook my mum a delicious fish pie. Uh, I've made it super mum friendly because there's loads of stuff she can and can't have now. Um, so we've done that. So back from the walk, uh, it was really nice and literally I pulled onto the drive and it stopped raining. The sun came out and it's been glorious. Oh well, girls had fun which is great. They're just having their dinner so while they're doing that I just thought I'd have a look at my delivery that arrived today. Yay! I needed a new food diary. I've been looking through the princess planning stuff that she had on her Instagram and online because I absolutely love the style. They're really cool colours and they're just perfect for what I really need really. Not a sponsor or anything, just really like her stuff. So I decided to get a new food diary and organiser, some new note paper and like some to-do list paper because you know me, I love a list. I'm quite excited to go through it. Now, while I play with my new food organizer diary stuff, I've made myself an iced coffee in my Cabana Bay Orlando Resort super mug. Oh, good times. I'm just gonna chill with this and have a play with my new stuff. I'm excited. I love new stationery and stuff. It's so exciting. Hey guys, it's Thursday and it's lunchtime. So I thought I would just finish up what I'm doing and then have some lunch. Today I started off the day pretty good. I just had some scrambled eggs and some mushrooms on a piece of toast to use at my Healthy Extra B, which was yum. It's lunchtime, so I'm not really sure what I'm gonna do today. We got some like leftovers knocking about, so I could do something with those. I think ultimately, I think I'm probably gonna do some vegetables and some rice and some salmon. It seems like quite a lot for lunch, but I'm trying to have more for lunch than I am for tea and just maybe have a little snack for tea, like some fruit or something. Um, and I do love salmon, salmon's amazing. Especially with like a drizzle of sweet chili sauce on the top, it's really good, I think I'm gonna do that. And then like I said for tea, I'm just gonna keep it really simple. I'm just gonna have some fruit, might have some strawberries and banana with a yogurt. Yeah, pretty boring food day. Oh well. Hey guys, it's the end of the week and pretty much had a really good week. Some really good food throughout the week to keep me going, which has been good. Though I've been feeling a bit up and down. Overall, yay, good week. For breakfast today, kept it pretty simple. Just had some oats and a banana with a squidge of honey. My huge, absolutely love it. Sin for the honey, so that was good. Then for lunch today, I just made some pizza fries and had a little side salad with that, which was amazing. Love pizza fries, super filling, and you can kind of put whatever topping you want on. If you want to check out my recipe for that one, I've put a link in the description below. And then for tea, I've not really needed anything else. So I think I'm just gonna have some fruit a bit later. I've still got some pineapple and also got some so I might have some of that instead of like a big meal. 
Mm, sounds pretty good. Hope your week's been good and I hope your way day is fantastic, whatever day that is. Fingers crossed for mine tomorrow. Don't forget to drop me a comment and let me know how you're getting on and if you've got any good tips or tricks on your weight loss and how to stay on plan, let me know. Until next time, guys.